Hi there, I'm Pamela and we're in my kitchen where I share with you some of my favorite recipes or those most requested by friends and family. Today is going to be a short little video, but I want to show you a quick and easy way to whip up some cream in a jar. So instead of dirtying a bowl and getting out your electric mixer and all that, this is just quick and easy and it's actually kind of fun. If you've got guests over or your family's around, they can help you shake the jar because it's going to take four or five minutes and your arm's going to get tired. So I do advise you get some help. I've got some heavy whipping cream right here and I'm going to fill the jar about half full because cream expands. We don't want to, that's a little more, a little more than half. We don't want to fill it all the way or we'll have nowhere to go when air starts getting into the cream. Now I'm going to add about a half a teaspoon of vanilla. and just a scoop of powdered sugar. I don't like my whipped cream too sweet. You can add to taste however amount you want. Now I've chilled the jar and the lid in my refrigerator for about an hour. Now all we're going to do is shake it. Just shake and shake and shake. And you're going to know that it's finished when you cannot hear liquid sloshing around anymore. So when your hand gets tired and your arm gets tired, hand it off to somebody else in your party or your family. And uh, you've got a real quick, easy way to whip up cream. I've actually got a fruit tart in my oven right now, and this is gonna be a nice topping for that. And I will add a link to that recipe so that you can make that one for yourself as well. Okay, I've been shaking this with the help of my cameraman for about five minutes. And as you can see, it has filled the jar and we have nicely whipped cream. This is gonna be really nice on my fruit tart. Now, when you don't hear anything sloshing around anymore, check it. If you keep shaking it, you're gonna wind up with butter. So same thing if you're mixing whipping cream in a bowl. If you whip it too much, you're gonna wind up with butter. So it would be a sweet butter with you know some vanilla in it too. But anyway, that's how to make whipped cream in a jar. If you're enjoying my videos, please give them a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you next time, bye.